everyone, sorry if it's a bit echoey, but welcome back to my channel. If some of you are new here, my name is Gary, aka The Plastic Boy. I upload on a Sunday, a Wednesday, and every other Friday for Sip and Slay, which you, if you are not subscribed, please click that subscribe button and make sure your notifications are on because when something juicy and hot drops, make sure you are there to watch it. So anyway, um, I get this question so much and I kind of like, I'm not sure why I don't film this because I do my skincare every day, but I'm gonna film like my everyday morning skincare routine. I can do a night one if you guys like this, but my skincare routine changes so much, I'm not gonna lie. No matter if I'm drunk, no matter if I am going through it, I always do my skincare um, for the past maybe two to three months I've been using the same thing um, moisturizer actually this cleanser is quite new but I've actually almost finished it and it's actually really really good so I'm going to take you through so if you so if you guys want to see what the skincare is, is saying keep on watching <laughs> So I kind of like think of this as my skincare routine because even though it's hair, it's still on my skin. So if you guys didn't know, I'll link it down below. I actually had um, a hair transplant. So this is the um, foam they gave us from the clinic, which is Asli Tarkan. And what I kind of do, I kind of pump it and I kind of pull it in the implanted area. You don't need this much, but you kind of leave it in the hair. Well, I say for 20 minutes, but I kind of leave this in my hair maybe for 30 minutes. And then I kind of do this before my skincare because I'll jump in the shower and then after I'll do my skincare. Okay, so I've been trying to shower, I've shampooed my hair, I should have showed you the shampoo, but I'm gonna do an updated hair thing, but I'll show that in there because ciao. Um okay, so I kind of go through different cleansers, but I've kind of been using the same one. I normally keep my cleanser in the shower. I know you're not supposed to really shower or cleanse your face in the shower because of the heat temperature but child it works for me nothing has been going on but this is the cleanser i've been using and this is by if i see this i feel like i'm one of those vault tutorials <laughs> this is the kale and green tea spinach vitamin superfood cleanser by youth to the people so youth to the people i think are a straight i'm not sure where the base actually but i know their products are amazing they recently only came to the uk last year on cold beauty and, and this cleanser everyone brags with their friend you can see look, look how much i've used and I know it's a glass bottle, so it feels really luxurious, but obviously this wouldn't be amazing with travel. And what I normally do, I wet my face, and then I'll probably do like one, two, two of these, and I kind of like lather it up in my hand. My clothes getting all wet. And then I kind of go like this. I kind of like do it so close, like someone's giving me a facial. I kind of cleanse maybe like 60 seconds to like 90, just depending on time. I've got my contact lenses in, by the way. People are gonna ask what contact lenses these are. I only wear Desio. Well, I've got another brand I'm testing out. But these are Desio, and these are in the shade Cappuccino. I do have a discount code, which will be in the description box, but I have my hands like this. Okay, so this is a step that is so vital if you wear makeup and you know sometimes as you wear makeup some depth builds up in some areas you can't really get to and I feel like sometimes we just need like a mild exfoliation. So these are the elements. Can I see this? These are the dynamic resurfacing facial pads are kind of like skin smoothing. They are so good. Um, you can see I've used so much. I love taking these on a the holiday because I find that like when I'm in the sun my skin can get quite dry so it just kind of takes those bits off. I kind of just take one or two and the area where I get kind of dry is like here, here, and then around my mouth, I'll do some of the jaw as well, like here. I don't go really go close into the eye because these aren't like super strong, but you don't want to go too close to the eye. I probably can use one to be fair because my skin isn't that bad at the moment, but these are definitely like top five, but not number five. <laughs> By the way, it's like nine o'clock in the morning here, so I am truly doing my skincare routine. So you can see these kind of give my skin a bit of life and juice. Okay, so if you've been rocking with me for a while, you're on. I think I've done one of these before, but not for ages. But if you follow my Instagram, you would know the fresh black tea kombucha. I've literally gone through two of these, and guys, these last 
so freaking long like they last like almost for like a year um i love them because it's like an essence and i always use the essence because these are kind of what's going to make your skincare just like you know absorb more into your skin i just love fresh i love what all they're about i don't use a lot of their products but i love the kombucha um oh where should i put this okay you just put some in your hand there's no kind of stuff on this smells literally like tea but you know how tea is really good for you i kind of prep them I kind of do loads just so my face is quite moist. Am I putting on makeup today? Am I? Um, should I actually put on putting on makeup today? What well, about putting on makeup on this morning? Because I've got somewhere to go. Yeah, and I can't leave that in. Like, I kind of leave it on to dry, but we're going to go to my beauty room. Because that's where I kind of do all my skincare in there, because that's where my products are. And then, yeah. Okay, so I have all my lights on. As you can see, my skin has still got a bit of tackiness from that, um, Essence. Um, I, this is this is the room. I, this is the room I put my beauty stuff in. So the lights are a bit like bright, but I think because where my apartment is situated, I don't get in. I do get a natural daylight, but the apartment owner didn't put blinds in, so anyone can literally see what I'm doing. Plus, I'm not half naked. So um, I would go in next with some hyaluronic acid. This is the one. Mm, I go. I don't. This is not like one of my staples, but this one is amazing. I just started using it because I saw a girl on TikTok speak about it. So I was like, I've got this. But normally, what well, I've been using that I'm used to the people one, which I've used so much of. This one's quite new, and this one's called the Cactus Oasis, and they're both different, but. I do like the texture of this one, but I'm gonna use this one for today because I'm, I'm on a skin suitacles hype. Whoops, I'm almost finished this actually, child. I need to get some more. And skin suitacles, by the way, guys, is not cheap. That's what I'll say. But the only thing about this hyaluronic acid, I feel like it's a bit sticky. So, let me see. Yeah, you can see, but this one, I definitely tell the difference. So this one is definitely a bit more concentrated. You see, this gives my skin that glow. I kind of go into the eyes as well because my eyes are always so flipping dry. Next is eye cream. I'm gonna go with this Origins. This is the Ginseng eye cream. This is a new one, so it's kind of colored, so it has kind of like a peachy kind of top to it. Um, eye creams, I don't think eye creams really do much, but they're just good if you want to put concealer on and your under eyes. Oh, my battery's coming. Oh no. They're just good if you're gonna put on concealer and you want your under eyes to be a bit more moisturized. Oh my God, I cannot believe my camera deciding to die right now. I'm so annoyed. So I'm then gonna go in with some vitamin C. This one is the Silly Martin, Silly Marine CF from Skin SkinCeuticals. You know what? I don't really use vitamin C that often, but I've been trying to use it more. Um, TikTok skincare has literally, oh, this has such a weird smell though. Again, all our hair to do an amazing SPF. I mean, Vitamin C, this is the one I use. Like, oh, it's the glow. You know who does a really amazing um, vitamin C? Sunday Riley, the CEO one. It's honestly amazing. Like, I love it so much, but you see the glow, child. The glow. Guys, know what moisturizer I'm gonna use? I've been loving the Ola Hemixin Strength Trainer Peptide Boost. Moisturize, I'm surprised I got that name right. I'm um, actually worked with them on this, but I've been using it because I just love it. I love the texture. It's, it's the most unique moisturizer texture I have ever used. Um, it's kind of like a balm to kind of like, just like a jelly balm, but um, it's really moisturizing. Look at that. But I feel like it's not greasy. It, just, it dries down, it does kind of set, but this is just so beautiful, especially for the winter months. Like my skin looks like glass. Let me zoom you in. You can literally see the texture of this moisturizer. I don't put too much in here. Because that's why I want to make it oily. But it's just so gorgeous. Okay, so I've got to hurry up before my battery goes because child, it's going to take me a long time. But Charles is coming right. So I'm going to go with my SPF. This is really, this is like 20 pounds. This is the Vichy Capital Soleil UVA Daily SPF 50. Always wear SPF 50. I don't care if it's winter. I just always wear 50. I love this texture because it, feel, it looks really wet when you see it, but it literally dries down and has no white cast and it gives your skin such a beautiful glow. Mm, I probably should have used it with this moisturizer, but it does dry down and you can blot it with powder and the tissue if you want to. Okay, so I can't remember where I was. My battery died, so I had to charge it for a bit, but I think the last step I was doing, I was applying SVF. So I love this Summer Fridays Lip Butter Balm. So good. And this is in the shade Vanilla Beige. Like even this with a liner would look good. It's kind of like 
a nude shade like it's so good it's also really good as like a lip mask look at how nude it is it's such mm, such a good one they do it in like a deeper shade as well i'm not sure if i have it but they do these in deeper shades summer fridays highly highly recommend and that's what i probably kind of left leave off really while my camera was charging i did my brows a bit i just did like a little bit of like a brow pen i don't do too much because in the daytime i'm not really done off like that and then obviously if I, I'm gonna be extra like me, you guys know. I don't think I've, I've spoken about this brand of video. No, oh, my head is itching me. So this is from Amanda Harrington. This is kind of like a tan, you guys know, I used to like love the tan looks. I still do. I'm actually gonna show you a step after using tan looks, but I don't really use the tan as much because it used to make my hands orange unless I was wearing a glove. So this is called the Illuminating Face Mist. It does come with a, with a gradual tan lotion, but I'm not gonna use that today. And this is really good if you wanna contour without using like an actual contour. So what you let me do, you spray this on this brush and this is like the um, lifting brush but you can use any brush like child and then you kind of just go like this. Can you see? It's not orange at all and it kind of dries down. I think it's the lights but it is like a natural olive finish and what I like about this, this is very neutral. It's not like too warm but this would be amazing on holiday or like just if you want to like use something like while you go out in the sun just to give your face a bit of definition i love this like i actually use it before bed because it kind of works better that way because it kind of like gives your skin like this really nice natural stain i do the ears as well and oh my god it's my court case today by the way guys you'll find out about what happens in the vlog but obviously mm, i'm a bit nervous but it's fine and just look at the finish it gives you. It actually looks more intense because I've got the lights on, but I promise you in person, it's not that intense. You'll see when I once again in the car anyway, it's not, it does dry down. I'll put some nose, the lids, just to give me a bit of, ooh, just to give me a bit of color. Ciao. Actually, it's looking remember, and this is looking super, super, I actually kind of like the color actually. I think it's because my face is still moisturized like quite dewy i feel like if your skin's a bit matte it doesn't come out this color but i'm not mad at it though okay um okay so this is ugh, i love this product from tan Lux. this is called super gloss um why is this not focusing child um i actually wore this yesterday when i went where's that called yesterday when i went to harrods for my nail appointment and everyone kept asking have you got makeup on i was like no she just got this on like i don't really wear makeup if i'm gonna do makeup yeah it has to be either all in or mm, it depends really but it's either all in so this is like their um illuminating drops with spf 30 and i'm just gonna put some on the cheek like that put some here and then i kind of take a makeup brush this is just like a makeup forever one and i literally just buff this in like this it's so nice obviously it's, these aren't really dewy they're literally just illuminating drops with spf and they give this skin such a nice glow you can even use your fingers like literally that's how sheer they are like they won't like get onto your clothes well i'm not sure about that they could get into your clothes and then i kind of blend it with the brush like that so it's kind of like makeup but not but look at the skin child and that's my that's my skincare routine really i don't normally do these two i'll probably leave it at the spf but i'll leave over link down below, links down below but this honestly this is so flipping good and i've actually got another one from another brand called pa pay pie called pie and these ones are a bit more highlighted but this is kind of like a soft golden glow but hope you guys have enjoyed the video let me guys know what you're using your current skincare routine and like uh, by the way i've got no more to oily skin so no more here no oily here no more here so oily combo normally so child but yeah i hope you guys like the video i shall see you in my next one